What's up, Grizzlies fans? Welcome into Grizzlies Training Camp presented by Ortho South. I'm standing here with David Roddy. Now, David, for a lot of yesterday, we talked to players and they were like, communication still needs to be improved. It's always going to be improved. I was standing outside the store for a big chunk of the practice. It was loud in here. How would you rate how the team is communicating today? Yeah, it's improving. Uh, you know, we talked about it yesterday in our first day, just setting a new standard for our defense as well as just our, our organization. Uh, I think that's something that has been um, you know, something that we need to work on and we improved today and hopefully we'll even improve tomorrow. We talked about this on Media Day. You were a big vocal leader at Summer League yeah. and now you're not a rookie coming in. There's a couple young guys on the team this year, but a lot of guys who have been through training cramps before. Uh, do you still feel like you could be one of those vocal leaders on this team? Yeah, that's what I, you know, try to aim to do um, every day, you know, just try to be consistent with it. Uh, you know, it's a comfortable role for me, so I just want to, you know, have my teammates, you know, hold me accountable to that as well as, um, you know, again, it comes from the right place. So I'm just uh, excited for the opportunity and I'll hold myself accountable for that. All right. The next few questions, I know it's only two practices in, so stay with me. Coach Jenkins did talk about, you know, setting new standards and not letting things slide and like really like changing the vibe around here for practices. Two practices in, what's impressed you the most about this team? I think it's just the energy. Uh, the energy doesn't drop. You know, these practices are, are pretty long, um, but you know, we're, we're high energy and we're high focus at, uh, all the way through. So I think that's something that separates us from, you know, uh, previous years. And uh, I'm just excited again for tomorrow. Now, this is your second training camp. So you know what to expect going into this, even I guess halfway through right now, a little over halfway through, what's the most difficult aspect of training camp? I think it's just uh, getting guys on the right page. You know, we have uh, a lot of new guys and, um, you know, some returners as well. And again, it comes back to the communication part of, you know, bringing those guys in and try to have a seamless transition. Uh, you know, we have Gigi and then Derek and Marcus as well. And, uh, you know, a couple of other new guys. So uh, for them to just kind of tag along and try to, you know, transition seamlessly is, is the biggest challenge, but we're doing a really good job with that. A guy like Gigi, never had a training camp before. What do you say to him to like get him ready and, and keep him through? You're saying these are long practices. I know they're grueling. I know it's like a lot of cardio, a lot of everything that's tiring. What do you say to him to keep him going? Man, just uh, listen, learn, and, and try to apply it as fast as you can. Uh, you know, watch the guy ahead of you and, um, you know, just really just take advantage of all the reps that you're, that you're getting. So, uh, you know, he's been doing really well. Uh, and, you know, I know he'll improve uh, every day that he's here. Okay, last but not least, I know it's exhausting. I can tell that everyone is tired when you walk in here. You can feel the exhaustion. Uh, you got to have a little bit of fun, whether that's even on the sideline with a joke with the player. Name one fun thing that happened today. One fun thing that happened today, uh, Desmond Bain tried to dunk the ball. He caught a lob and uh, he didn't. He, he barely got up and fell. So he, That's only fun if you're not on his team. Yeah, it was old man legs. I mean, it wasn't, it wasn't in live play or anything like that. He was just trying to play around and the joke was on him. So. <laughs> Thank you, Roddy. I appreciate you so much. Stay tuned into Memphis Grizzlies all week long. We've got you covered here. It's all presented by Ortho South.